I got this whole idea one early morning when we were home listening to the radio and then they started playing this song. Like, I mean, it brought my memories and brought back the day. So I jumped on YouTube to look for the song and was titled Joke by Professor Kofi Abraham. And I was like, let me just sample it because, I mean, back in the days, I really liked this song. <laughs> Near your sunny penny, and I be not yet. Situation be dear, you be so dear. She break with others, and you'll be no big dancing. We don't come out, come out, how I channel can it be yet. So, this is how the main song sounds. It's a bit slow, but I mean, because of some last class in them. So, I chopped, I did my chopping, my sample choppings, and then it came to my playlist. And this is how I. This is how I arrange them on the playlist. And then I added the chorus as well. So I, I added the I fused in the chorus of the main song with this one so that anyone who gets to beat, who gets a beat to rap on, will just use that one as a chorus. So, and then I, after getting the samples right, I start with the the snare and the clap. I chose this snare and this clap and this snare. The normal Afro kind of snare and clap. And then I added uh, my hi hats. Then I added this afro but trap snare which made it a bit trappy like trap hip hop kind of vibe. So although it's high life, it has this modern trap in it. And then I added this one. Then I went straight to adding um, this purity sound, more like the bamboo, which has. So this is how I, I added the, the. This is the melody I play. Then um, we linked up, I mean I paused at, at this part and then we linked up with Tubani. Amado was like, let's hit Tubani up. Like I was at Bukuma at that time. So he was like, okay, let's just hit Tubani studio and then try and get something done. And then when we got there, Tubani was like, Charlie, this bit is crazy. Let's let's try, let's work on it. So he decided to add this bass to it to give it this much more heavy feel. Because I hadn't played the 8 with at that time. So this was the base he added. I was just repeating, was just looping itself till we got to the chorus. So this is how it's. And that basically gave me the idea for the new tools because I need to know what to play for the new so let's get to the it. That's the most amazing part of the whole beat, apart from the sample. So I added this eight oh eight for my slides as usual. And then to make it a bit like Different from the regular 808, I put I added this gross beat on it, the one over four, 
and I automated it. So this is how it sounds. So that's how it all sounds. Let's listen to how everything sounds. added some effects to the vocals, did some mixing, mastering, boom, we released the song the following day because it was unplanned. So it was like, let's just drop it. We didn't even do any cover for the song, but then as time, as time went on, like people were just vibing to the song, people were liking the song and then they were giving feedback, like positive feedback, because they didn't expect anything like that. So that's how we made that straight banger. Catching on the time, PS Media Studios, two months here, we're out. Boom.